On Thanksgiving, many of us enjoyed an abundance of food at the table. Still, the pandemic has revealed how many Americans are one paycheck or medical bill away from hunger. Here's CBS's Maria Villarreal. Out of work and out of food. I need turkey, I need meat. These massive giveaways in Denver, Miami, and Dallas have become the new lines of the times. Unemployment, everything is sky high. So this, this is a great help for everybody. Beyond the holiday season, Feeding America projects more than 50 million Americans will have faced hunger in 2020, up from around 35 million before the pandemic. Simply put, people don't know where their next meal will come from. The North Texas Food Bank's Erica Yeager says they're serving 10 million meals a month. That's 4 million more than this time last year. History tells us that we can expect to see this elevated need for at least the next two years. Schools like the Texas Khan Academies are also helping hungry families. Brandi Glasgow lost her home health care job during the pandemic and is scraping by as a seasonal worker for FedEx. As a mother, you never want your kids to see you uh, worry or panic. So it got a little hard and got a little questionable there. Did you have money in your bank account? No. In Texas, more than 2 million kids are expected to go hungry this year. A reality 17 year old, Michael Glasgow, is now facing. Right now, I'm trying to uh, graduate and get a job. So that'll help, like, with the bills and stuff. <laughs> it's a wake up call for a generation coming of age in the midst of a pandemic. Mireya Villarreal, CBS News, Dallas. That likely won't get better soon.